Hello, my name is Representative Joe Varengia, and I'm asking for your vote on November 8th. For the past six years, it's been an honor to represent my friends of the 20th General Assembly District in Hartford. I want to thank all of you who have contacted me to express your concerns, offer advice, and even question a vote or two. I want to highlight three achievements from this past legislative session relating to economic growth, transportation, and most importantly, our state budget. Economic growth, I worked to secure a $5 million state loan to assist in the development of 616 New Park Avenue, a $20 million mixed-use transit-oriented development on New Park Avenue. The property was the old Pontiac Center. I'm confident by investing in this project, it will serve as a gateway for additional private investment along the New Park Avenue corridor. Transportation received funding for aesthetic improvements of the New Britain Avenue, New Park Avenue Bridge, as well as funding to study the I-84 section of West Hartford, often referred to as the S-curves, a section of highway that's been the scene to numerous rollovers and fatal accidents. State budget restored funding to hospitals, helped small manufacturers fund capital improvements and train their workforce, and did not increase taxes. However, my work is not finished. With your vote on November 8th, I'm committed to working on an agenda that includes investing in Connecticut. So what exactly does that mean? It means supporting businesses and spurring job creation, restructuring property taxes, assisting our seniors, and investing in our young people. While out on the campaign trail going door to door, I'm always reminded how special West Hartford really is. That is why I'm not surprised that Money Magazine recently rated West Hartford as the top 15th place to live in the United States. Thank you for your continued support, and with your vote on November 8th, I look forward to representing you at the Capitol.